Here with UT Dallas men's soccer coach Jack Peel. Coach, congratulations on advancing to another ASC soccer tournament. The comments open up Friday after a bye. What's your thoughts on the regular season and how your team earned that first round bye? Well, I think we had a great season, and it was maybe what we expected. I don't know, maybe a little more than what we expected. But we kind of still have a young team, but it was awesome to uh, to gain gain the bye because it's such an advantage going into the tournament. You don't have to play on Thursday. You get the rest day. You don't have one more day to travel. On Friday, you get the uh, one game and the same game on Sunday. Talk about how now with that new format, is it easier for a team to win this? I, uh, I don't know if it's – I think it makes the final a better final because if it's very difficult if you have to play, you know, two games in a row, three games in a row to get in. So having to buy in between is going to help. And it even a, it's even a bigger advantage, too, that if you've gotten the uh, – if you've gotten the original buy and you don't have to play back-to-back -back games, it helps. It makes, I think it's going to make a better final. Two seniors on the team, Brian Benhoff, Robert Lopez. What is expected of those two seniors in this postseason play? Well, just to do what they've been doing all year long. Brian is the captain of the team, a leader of the team, and, and uh, Robert's got the personality and the spark of the team. He's had three game winners. And you just hope that your top players, all your best players, you know, show up to play and led by those two guys. Michael Darrow putting together one of the best offensive seasons in school history. Uh, do you think teams are trying to shut him down more than normal? Well, and I told him as the season went on, and especially now, is that I said you can't hide anymore. <laughs> they know he's there, and he's going to be tough for him. And yeah, I think you know every time he gets the ball, he's got two or three players around him, which you know, in all fairness, should open up some other players to get you know to get in to help us out a little bit. Comments open up Friday at two p.m. at the ASC tournament.